Hi, today I'll be making some lentil tosa. This is a really healthy and very easy thing to make at home. It's soft, yummy and really delicious. It's perfect for breakfast, dinner or even as a snack. I'm sure your children will love to have this as well. Just take one cup of all lentils. It doesn't matter what the lentil is, whatever lentils you have, just put one cup each. I'm adding one cup of rice, also a teaspoon of dill and soaking it. After it has been soaking for about one hour, now I'm going to grind it. So a piece of ginger, a little bit of cumin seeds and of course a little bit of sweet cumin and I'm going to grind all this with a little bit of curry leaves. This curry leaf and ginger gives a lovely flavor and it helps digest the tose better. Adding a little bit of water just to make the grinding process easier. When ground properly, this is the texture I'm looking at. So it's not very smooth, but it's ground really well. Now when I'm grinding the second batch, I'm adding a little bit of salt as well. Mix the two mixtures together and leave it for about half an hour. If it's very thick, you can add a little bit of water and check the salt as well. You want, before making the toasters, you can even temper some onions and put it in. Now I have my pan really hot and ready. So I'm going to pour the toaster. You can put a little bit of ghee in the pan if you like the toaster to be really crispy and of course super delicious. But today I'm not adding because I'm going slow on the oils. The healthier version is without oil. When the dosa has cooked on one side, you can slowly turn the other side and add a little bit of oil or ghee when cooking the other side as well. That gives a nice crispy and yummy taste. Making this yummy delicious lentil tosa at home is super easy now it's time to serve the delicious tosas this is how it looks perfect and it tastes amazing you can serve it with a little bit of chutney or any curry it's really delicious and so easy to make I have shared the recipe for coconut chutney before. I'm going to share that down below in the link as well. If you want to try it out, this is perfect with that chutney. So I'm sure you're going to try this lentil tose at home. Let me know how it goes. So until I meet you next, happy cooking and bye for now. Enjoy your dosas. Just like I did right now. <laughs>